Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only. Today I'm going to be playing The Law of Creation. Now, this game is on Google Play or the Q app, whichever one you want to choose. I chose the Q app because I didn't know it was on, you know, the Google Play store. But yeah, without further ado, we're going to get into it. I've been playing this game for at least six days as of right now. Oh, no, five days, actually. And so far, it's actually pretty interesting. The play style of the game is actually pretty interesting. It has a lot of different, like, modes you guys can go into. Uh, first things first, story mode. We have quite a bit of story we can go through. Pretty sure 23 is the last one. And plus, you got your extras, where it's just pretty much harder ones. And you don't go through waves on here, I'm pretty sure. At least I think. Don't actually remember. And events are at level... 30. Jesus Christ. I am level 25. It is kind of easy to level up in this game, but they do kind of slap a few limits on you. Like, if you're VIP 0, you can't buy more than one stamina recharge. And if... I mean, I don't know about that, because normally you would just have at least two stamina recharges when you're just not, like, in a VIP at all. Pretty sure you get another energy, right? No cooldown on the dorm challenge. Dorm challenge is pretty much, um, climb the ladder. Uh, yeah, you get two energies, recharges, if you were to get to VIP one. Yeah, I don't know about that. I would rather have two recharges as I'm just Z VIP zero. That would make it way better just because that kind of throws off like free players and they probably are going to play for long at that point if because here's the thing most games if you can't play it for long people will get bored of them and tired of it and move on i just want to put that out there oh god let's go to the next mission and show you guys the play style now that I got that ran out of the way. <laughs> I'm just saying that. It's just a common thing. You guys can go through the story if you guys want to. Um, Alright, first things first. Alright, yeah, I can explain it here. Now, this is your energy pool. You're going to need a certain amount of energy just to use your character's skills. And right off the bat, your characters start pretty much uh, on cooldown so they can't use their skills right off the bat. The only skill you can use right off the bat is your assist. Wow, that person's actually has some real good damage. Oh dear god. And plus you have like little abilities over here you can use once a uh, match. Which are actually really good. And this game keeps trying to put me on auto. As you can see, I'm at 9. Yeah, so pretty much every skill you use takes up mana from like your energy pool. That just went totally backwards. It takes energy from your energy pool, not mana from your energy pool. And as for extra quests, the materials you get are these. And these are for enhancing the equipment that the characters have. I think I po chose the wrong thing. Well, this is guilds, pretty much. So now I can just go over here and enhance all of my stuff. If I have the stuff. If that makes sense. And this is the back stuff. I'm pretty sure you can only get this, well, these things at like level 20. I recommend do enhancing these as much as you guys can because these are extremely helpful towards the characters and then they start to do some serious damage and have some serious survivability which is when it's just HP but always make sure that these are like up to date I did save off this video just because uh, I wanted to get the 10 summon just to summon with you guys. So let's do that. See what we get. So every like 
five summons, you get an uh, SR. Seems like I got a duplicate, but that's good, I guess. Oh, I got a SSR. What? No way. That's actually extremely good. Hold up. Let me go look at him. Well, first things first. Can I, uh... Star up? Nah, I need another 10. Roster. Where is he? Has anybody said anything? Oh, so he only has single targets. Ah, man. Let's see. He attacks up to five times with random damage and slows down attack speed. What about this? Okay. Yeah, he seems really good for burst. Sweet. But there are other challenges like this special trial you can go through, which is pretty much like go dungeon which is pretty much like xp dungeons and also then you got the dorm challenge where you're supposed to climb up the ladder i'm not sure if i can beat these people now sort of got to a point where people were kind of kind of like a challenge i gotta level up some more things then you got endless road where it's just pretty much hmm, how can i explain it they pretty much climb stage and every like 10 stages you get like the choose stats from it so yeah pretty sure people understand that one uh these i cannot enter into a certain like level i'm guessing this is world boss maybe and then there's survival which i get at level 30 and this is pretty much um boss raids you can get through like the story Pretty sure I can actually try and get one. If I can get the material. So let me go ahead and show you guys how to enhance these guys. So this is a common material just to, you know, kind of advance them. Uh, this is where you can level them up. I'm gonna level him all the way. All right, there we go. And if you're trying to star up, uh, you're gonna need universals or their actual like duplicates. This is another fragment game, by the way, if you guys haven't figured that out yet. There's a lot of fragment games lately. I'm gonna put 10 into here. Just because you're kind of limited to how much you can actually put in. All right, let's go get these materials and see if we can get a boss. This game is fairly simple. It it kind of walks you through everything, even if you don't want to be walked through it. But it's actually fine. All right, let's put the rest into this. So far, my team has been coming out pretty nicely. This is my strongest one. The ones you start off with are Phoenix and the main character. Then once you complete, I'm pretty sure the first stage, you get her. And then I'm pretty sure later on you get the witch. The other ones, these two, I got from like summon. Oh, actually, I got this one for summon. I got this one from like sharing on Facebook, I, I think. And this one's also a free one. So yeah, you get some fairly decent free units. I wouldn't say that they're the best, but you definitely want to summon. Well, I'm going to say you definitely want to do a 10 summon, so at least save up. It, it took me like five days to save up for just one 10 summon. So yeah, keep that in mind. Definitely keep that in mind. But also, you guys are probably wondering, why does my character have like a mate outfit on? 
That that's just me. <laughs> you actually wear different costumes for her, and she will actually get bonus stats. So this is the little ability that the maid outfit does. Pretty much ignites a target for just a few seconds and it's actually pretty decent. You'll notice it. It's like little fireballs going around a certain enemy. Uh, as for this one, this one just increases the defense of front units. Then there's more. Some of it you can't actually buy. Just because I'm pretty sure you have to be in a certain mood for them. Some of them are like behind VIP paywall. I wouldn't doubt it if you would just unlock the rest of them. And they would just be like, oh, sorry. Not the right VIP. <laughs> then there's certain events you can do up here, like pretty much log in. And I, I'm i getting this one tonight. Then. Okay. Then there's rankings and stuff for like power and other random crap. Let's just say that. <laughs> Oh yeah, I'm supposed to be over here trying to get a boss. What am I doing? I got distracted. These are actually easy to level up just because they're just gold. Alright, finally got that out of the way. Now, Awaken, you would need uh, these Awaken items, which are basically panties. Don't judge it. It's Japan. What do y'all think was going to happen? Oh, he's a magic... Damn. Oh, yeah. Duh, lightning. <laughs> and I can just pretty much enhance him as... Pretty much as far as I want. But these points... Are from that, um... Dorm challenge. So you have to, like... Do dorm challenge just to be able to level these two up. Well, you have to do dorm challenge to level this up. You have to do endless road to... You know, level this one up. See? Endless road coins. I don't really have much of them, so I can't advance it. But here, I can't advance it just because, you know, I got everything. To get those XP books, you have to pretty much log in and go to the event. Well, I don't think it's actually up anymore. But there's like this little thing that you had to click on. It gave you like different... Huh. Oh, and this is here, so... Yeah, that's another way to get him. It's I'm not really sh fully sure on the game yet because there are a lot of things I need to learn. So I can't give like a full on guide and tell you guys exactly everything to do because I'm still learning the game. That's going to be how it is. That's pretty much how it's going to be for all the games I play. I can't give you guys like a perfect guide. If I do make any mistakes, anybody can correct me on them. I don't mind. But, yeah, just letting you guys know. Taught you guys how to do that. Now, let's continue to try and get a boss. I'll be right back, guys. I still have not found a boss yet. I'm still searching. Are there no bosses here that want to actually, like, show up right now? Oh, yeah, you can't 10 because you also have to have VIP for that as well. I mean, every game does that, to be honest. So I'm not really fully worried about it. I got this guy to blue pretty easily. Game? You're gonna give me a boss already. I'm losing energy. I know I can't buy myself back in. Yeah, I only got like 25 energy left. Jesus. Yeah, the game's not giving me much to work with there. Doesn't seem like we're going to find a boss today, guys. Unfortunately. I tried. But yeah, I'm pretty sure you guys can look up the videos and try to find it yourselves. <laughs> Looks like I won't be getting it, though. But I will show you guys the... Um, well, attempt. What up? Where is it? You don't want to take out. Well, you kind of served your purpose for now. Kind of just want to try him out at the moment. I'm going to attempt a dorm challenge. 
Alright. Oh yeah, I supposed to change my team in there. Whoops, too late now. So yeah, it's pretty much just beat the other team. Uh yeah, this is kind of a I kind of thought this was gonna work out. Yeah. Her moves hurt. Oh, nice. Hold up. I was about to say, is there a chance we can win this? I don't think there is. Just because the main character still has an AoE. So, I don't know. I won. Alright. Oh, yeah, and that's another place where you can get those uh, XPs. Someone climbing up the ladder. But, yeah, guys, I'm going to end it there. Hope you guys enjoy. Try out the game yourselves. I think it's better presented if you do actually try it out. It's not half bad. It just has quite a bit of limits, which I personally do not like. But what do you expect when it's a VIP game? <laughs> Any game with a VIP, you're going to be limited. It happens a lot, unfortunately. But with that said, at least give the game a try. Till then, peace out.